Hey guys, Luke here. Uh, this is another episode of my AS Monaco crew match. Show. We're gonna get straight into into the game. Uh, I want to get another live com, which they all will be. We'll go with the black here this time. Um, let's play with our home kit. I guess they'll be the best uh, for it. So it's gonna be rainy. Uh, four minute halves, four class. Let's go into it. I think the change we made is. Um, Bring in Hazard for Royce at the right mid position. I think um, Contreras come in for Denny Alves at the left back position, and Abdenor, um he's out with uh, Kurt Zuma coming in. Kurt Zuma's a bit of a weird one. I thought he'd be rated a lot higher at this point. I mean, I didn't buy him until like maybe like last season or something. Got him for like two million or something pretty cheap, but um, yeah, I thought he'd be a little bit higher. Reigns, not a big fan of Reigns in this game. He's gonna cross it. It's a good block by them. Good run by Old Charlie. Let's get to that Ferrati, and we're not gonna get to it. Like a Z. I'm not sure if that's how you actually pronounce it. It might be just Lacazette, but I think it's Lacazette. I think that's how I heard people pronounce it before. But that was a few years ago when he wasn't as well known. I mean, he's not really that well known now, but... Yeah, goal to Balotelli. I saw, saw the run there. can't remember who made the pass. Maybe the left mid? Nah, it can't be. He's left mid. El Shrawi. But we'll have a look at that finish again. Can't finish. I'm getting better at finishing on this game, um, which I think the crew mode's really helping me. Which hopefully I can take that over to Ultimate Team. Haven't played Ultimate Team in a little while. Um, pretty much the servers have been annoying me too much. Like I went, I was going to go play it before, but yeah. And also I find this. Oh shit! That was supposed to go to the left back, but it didn't. Oh, that was a fail. What a goal, what a shrock. What a rocket. It's a screamer. Come on. It's good clearance. But yeah, like the step up between like Division like 3 and Division 2 even. Like, that's I've got up to Division 2, that's where I've got up to. And I'm just like stuck there. I got, I got like, like I've never been on like more than like two game like losing streak like ever, up until up until um Division Two in this. Like I remember, like in the previous years FIFA getting D Division One and all that. Like I wouldn't even like lose at all. But this time, nope, not happening. Like I think I went on like a seven game losing streak. It was ridiculous. I guess you, you'll see that in my series um, at some point if it hasn't already happened. And if it haven't, it's kind of a spoiler. I probably shouldn't have talked about that, but it's too late now. Nice little play here. Cohen Trower just steps around him. Passes back to Cruz. Cruz has got a good shot on him. Gets blocked. Oh, that's terrible. I thought it was going to be a header. So he'd go in the air, but nope, there's a pass, it went along the ground, it's not good. It's kind of annoying, because you don't, you don't get that many opportunities, um, playing four minute halves, and we got a really good one early on, and we stuffed it, well we didn't stuff it, we took that opportunity, but we stuffed up with the goalkeeper. Come on, there we go, there's a goal. Eden Hazard. I haven't, I don't do too many finesse shots. I mean, in FIFA 12, finesse shots was like going in every time. And then they like nerfed it completely. Oh, sorry, they just like got rid of it completely. FIFA 13, and then because of that, I haven't really tried too many finesse shots. I mean, I don't know why, but the ones that I do tend to go in, but. Uh, I'm not sure what happened there. Hopefully it's going to keep recording. My um, 
the screen went black for a sec and I'm not sure why hopefully that doesn't mess with the recording at all because I'll be devastated I was trying to leave that how's that, oh I was going to say how's that stayed in Varati to El Sharawi. Oh, we're going to try and launch it across the hazard there, but it didn't work. That was a really, really bad defense there. I was trying to switch players and it wouldn't let me switch. There we go, Zuma, getting the ball there. Just going to lay it off for Colin Trower. He's going to go up the wing. Lay it off for Verratti. Gets Bello. Pass up to Fernando. And he's playing. There's a goal. Balotelli. Too easy. 45th minute. Nice goal there. You ain't going to stop him from inside, inside the box. It's not going to happen. Actually, to be quite honest, like 90% of strikers will not miss from there, on FIFA, that is. I'm not sure how much putting up difficulty, like how much of an effect that would actually have. I don't think it's worth doing it. Oh, we were going to score there for sure. Taking on Leon, probably would have been a game, like a good game to try out like a full strength side, but... I guess we can't because James Rodriguez is hurt. I don't know if I showed that, but he's hurt. So either way, it wouldn't have been a full strength. But Tony Cruz is rated like just just as good. No, actually, he's one less, but not too bad. And I, I was for like many seasons, I was like really harsh on Cruz. Like I've had him for a few seasons, and I was like planning on selling him, but just never got around to it. So I tried him, I tried him, I was like, oh, maybe I can use him as a CDM, because I don't like him as a cam. And it was alright, but... Just not... Mm. To have someone who's, like, supposed to be that good, just sitting on the bench, or sitting in CDM, just feels like he's being wasted. I can get the money. Even though you don't really need the money. Early cross in. Nice header there by Cruz. Well, getting into the nice spot wasn't really a good header, but... Too fair. The header was, well, the cross was targeted for Balotelli. It's a nice little ball there. I really need to yawn. And that was my yawn voice. I'm trying to talk. It's one of those things where you try and cover up. I think I saw a comedian talk about it. Yeah. Uh, like you try and you try and cover up the yawn, but it doesn't work. It's a really nice play there. Is that a foul? I was thinking that sometimes when you do that sort of stuff, you tend to foul them when you when you run into the play after you just get tackled. So Diaby's coming on. He might get injured in this game, maybe. Who knows? Very injury prone. Very, very talented, just very injury prone. So they got that was Diaby on the ball just then. See, I think it's getting to the point where a lot of these players. Like, a lot of the, the current top players, not just, like, the top players, but even, like, some, like, the fringe players that you've sort of heard of, like DRB, they're sort of on the outer now, getting too old. When I say, like, DRB, I'm sure there's going to be people who are fans of Arsenal, and are like, oh, DRB, but, like, let's be honest, if, like, if you didn't follow the Premier League or something, you probably don't know who DRB is. The whole time I was trying to do a rule out then. Oh, I thought that was going to be a nice tackle there. Good little tackle there. Oh, I thought we were going to get the ball back there with El Sharawi. Once again, I thought we were going to. Uh oh. Nah, it's alright, it's alright. Lacazette, 
He's very fast, but Zoom is Zoom is pretty quick. So they're going backwards again. Nice slide tackle there. He might make a sub. I always forget like the four minute ones. I'm used to playing six minute ones, and I forget how quick it goes. So I haven't even really been looking at the clock. And now the game is just about over. Bring on Falcao. We'll take Valo off a, on a hat trick. Um, we'll bring on Royce as well. Just yawned again. I, don't, I didn't really make a noise, so you won't pick up on it um, in the commentary. So, nothing to worry about, but. Uh, so I'd just make his all aware as to why he's a little bit quiet. Jeez, that's a soft goal. Riviere, or Riviere, whatever his name is. I think he's at PSG now, currently. I just hold him. But, did he did he used to play for Leon before that? I know he, he played in the French League before that, but I don't know who for. Ooh, that's a bad pass. So we can see the late goal. As soon as we bring on the subs as well, hopefully we don't collapse. It's a nice ball from him, it's going to go out, but when I say him, I don't really know who it was. It's hard, oh no. Uh oh. Thank God. I thought we blew that. I thought well, that was a game. It's going to be a draw. But nope. Making another sub, Nigel Dijon. I think. Is that dude? Yeah. Yatara. Oh, this time it goes to the wrong people. That time it went to who I wanted, but there was a player marked. Bit, bit sloppy at the moment. Got four. Ah, damn. In real life, if it's raining, the ball's gonna like, maybe like skid when it first bounces, but. Like it's gonna stop really quick, hit a puddle. Key thing is, like in real life, well, not real life, but against a real opponent, like they usually don't tend to just run straight, which is what the computer does. So when I go in to put pressure on them, and then, like I keep expecting them to like do like a turn or something so I can run onto it. Will not. Oh, I thought that was a really nice tackle. Oh, thank God. And we get the win. Bit tense, that win, but we'll take it. It's another win. With all goals in the first half for us, and they picked up one goal. Towards the end, but it's alright. We'll hurt our goal difference slightly, but we don't need a goal difference. But our aim is to win every game, so... Yeah, I don't know. Is that entertaining for people? If you're watching the gameplay, if I just win every game, I mean, you'd think, you'd think no, generally. But like with the team I got, like for them to lose, it seems quite unrealistic. Well, we got a Champions League game. How exciting! Against that underlect or whatever they're called. Yeah. And we got Abdenor wants to talk. We want to unnerve. Actually, no, we want to motivate our guys. And he will be replacing him for the next game, but that's where we're going to leave it for this episode. I'd like to thank you for watching. Um, if you enjoyed it, hit the like, hit the like button, or give it a thumbs up, whatever it is. I can't remember if it's actually, it is a like, but I can't remember if it says like. Maybe it's just a thumbs up there. So thumbs it up. Um, if you're old school, give it five stars. But it's not there anymore. Um, so yeah, subscribe to the channel for more, and see you for the next one. Alright, see you guys. Bye.